Hi, I'm Julie Kellner. I'm standing for a council this time because I have a basic philosophy, and that is that there is actually no such thing as council money, there's only ratepayer money. So if you have that in front of mind whenever you make a decision, it means that you actually have to speak to the community before those decisions are made. I think that this term, um, consultation with the community has been extremely poor, and I think that has to change. Mm -hmm. and, and tell me, so, so you, stood, you, you were previously a councillor and you didn't get elected um, on this current council. That's correct. Uh, how do you think that that has impacted you? Do you Incredibly positively. Um, with, with the benefit of hindsight, I'm actually really pleased I didn't get elected. And it's because it's given me a really good opportunity to reconnect with the community. Um, and I, if I had the opportunity to vote for it, I would say that all councillors should have fixed terms. Yeah. One term down and come back on again. Only one term? Um, no, maybe two terms, possibly three. Mm. But certainly to get back into the community. I can tell you with absolute honesty that an awful lot of long-term councillors are in a council spin bubble. They forget that they're, they're not spending council money, they're spending ratepayer money. Mm -hmm. And it's a really interesting point, isn't it, about reconnecting with the community Absolutely. And, and, and learning more about it. What are the key issues for you? Lack of consultation um, mm -hmm. a lot, a, a, around a many things that have happened this term. Um, the fact that most people know that I do stand with the pro-democracy society's um, elected members and that I feel that democracy has been done poorly by um, this term. We should not have unelected people sitting around the table. That's absolutely a no-no for me. Should we connect really strongly with Tiarawa and other groups? Absolutely. Um, but not this way. We do a couple of yes-no questions with, with candidates to find out you know, where they sit on various yeah. issues. The first one I'll ask you about is, is the Green Corridor or the Cycleway. Do you support that? No, I don't. No? Um, some of the mayoral candidates have suggested that any future rate increases should be kept to 2%. Do you support that stand? Not 100%, no. CPI is a much better way of sticking to um, lower rates. Um, the library and the health hub redevelopment, do you support what's happening there? No, I don't think rate my pay money should be going into health. Mm -hmm. in I think I know your answer to this yeah. question. Do you support the Te Arua partnership proposal? Not as it is. Not as it is. And just to finish off, Julie, can you maybe give us a little bit of a personal story about yourself, something, something which um, our viewers might like to know about you? Oh, absolutely. Um, so I've had a little bit more free time in the past three years and I started karate with my eight-year-old granddaughter and I absolutely love it. Um, I've got two gradings, I'm now an orange belt and I'm doing my first competition next weekend. Oh, excellent. So I adore it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Oh, well done and all the best for your campaign. Thank, Thank you. you.